Right. As many of you know, Fox Studios Fantastic Four 2, a sequel to the recent Fantastic Four reboot, was scheduled to come out in the summer of 2017. Recent comments by producer Simon Kinberg suggested that Fox still intended to make the sequel. However, according to Box Office Mojo, Fox has very quietly pulled Fantastic Four 2 from their release schedule and as of now has no project release date. John, is Fantastic Four 2 at Fox officially dead? Ah, uh, look, here's the thing. I I remember when, uh, long before Fantastic Four came out, and we were starting to feel maybe just a little bit optimistic. <laughs> and I'll, I'll tell you straight up, I was feeling a lot optimistic about Fantastic Four. And But even then, and Christian was feeling optimistic too, but even then, Christian, I remember saying that, you know, he did not think it was going to meet that 2017 release date. Mm -hmm. He said he would eat his shoe if he didn't meet that release date. And then they moved it by two weeks. And we said, no, 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 that doesn't count. You're still just, eating your shoe, guys. Yeah, <laughs> just move in two weeks. That doesn't count. Then we saw the movie. Yeah. And right. the, the <laughs> weather changed. Yeah. The atmosphere kind of changed. Now, just a few weeks ago, as Ashley was pointing out, you know, Simon Kimber's crammed out. Oh, no, no, we got vision for this. We got belief in this. And then ever so shh, very <laughs> quietly, Fox did not announce that they were pulling it off the release schedule. This was Box Office Mojo through their release calendar. That's how this came out. Fox, shh. Right. We're, we're murder on the Orient Express. <laughs> yeah, everybody. Look, Kenneth Braun yeah. is doing Murder on the Orient Express. Isn't that great? Yoink. Take yeah. out Fantastic Four 2. And, and look, it just makes sense. Look, I don't know if them pulling this off its release date. Because look, on one hand, this could just make sense that they're just pulling it off the release date because, you know, the last movie was such an unequivocal mess that they got to go back to the drawing board and we need time and there's no way we'd have a movie after 2017. Or it's what is, I think, probably more likely Fox going, it's time for us to wave the flag. You know, we've taken four cracks at this so far. Four cracks at the Fantastic Four. And ain't none of them worked. And maybe it's just time for them to go we give up. We've got something working out great with the X-Men universe. People are excited about Deadpool. Gambit is even getting buzz. We can probably say we've got it covered with all the properties we got. We can let Fantastic Four go. And, and I just think it's time. So I will not be shocked if we find out that they're going to be stubborn about it and they're digging in their heels. Saying, no, 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 no. Fantastic Four 2, 2018. But right now, I think it point, all signs point to them giving up on Fast Fantastic mm. Four. What do you think, Shep? Are we going to see from Fox a Fantastic Four 2? Absolutely not. I think all of us were waiting for them to pull the release date. It's just when were they going to do it? So even though they tried being slick and sly about it, that's why it's on every every <laughs> news site. They're like, they pulled it. It's like every you couldn't, have, uh, couldn't not see it if you were online last night. It was like everywhere. So I think everyone was waiting for them to admit defeat in a certain sense. Like, no, it's not. It didn't work. This isn't going to have a, a fan. There's not going to be a Fantastic Four 2 set in this universe. If they do anything, they'll bring in Brian Singer. But I don't think they're even going to do that. I don't think they're going to do an X-Men versus the Fantastic Four. I think what they're going to do is they're going to go back to Marvel and say, you can have Fantastic Four and Galactus and Silver Surfer and Doctor Doom as long as you give us the ability to make toys out of the X-Men. Because Marvel, Disney has been really, really smart about their strategy. They're like, yeah, yeah, we know you have X-Men and you have Fantastic Four. You can't have video games. You can't have toys. We're going to minimize those characters in the comic books, if not cancel them altogether. You're not going to see them in our posters. You're not going to see them anywhere. We're going to destroy them in the eyes of Marvel fans. So it's not going to work with X-Men. X-Men is still going to keep going. It's a great film series. You know, we got X Men Apocalypse. We got several other television shows coming out with X Men. Fantastic Four and all of the characters that are wrapped into Fantastic Four, I think, kind of should go back to Marvel because a lot of those characters like Galactus and Silver Surfer would work great within the, the setup. And even the Skrulls would work great within the setup that Guardians of the Galaxy already has with the Kree. That's like, it feels like, look, there's somewhere that those guys can make a deal. And like what, what Fox really wants is that video game money. They really want that action figure money. And that's what Marvel's like, no, 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 you're not getting that, son. Sorry, but we might be able to make a deal because they're never going to get X-Men back. That's just not no, happening. That's not happening. That's never going to happen. Fantastic Four, totally different story. So I think there's there's wiggle room in there. Here's the thing, though, for me with this whole thing about Marvel. 
I, I can understand Fox wanting those toy rights. If I'm Marvel right now, I ain't giving you nothing. You know why? Because you're dying on the <laughs> sidewalk. I just got to wait here like a vulture and pick the bones when, when the contract laps and you don't go into production on New Fast Test 4. I'm going to sweep in and get it. You know, for a long time I've said, right. but also if I'm Marvel, I don't even freaking want Fantastic Four. Nobody read the comic book. They, you know, Fox has totally destroyed the brand, and I'm doing great with everything I got. But then one of the readers pointed this out to me, which I thought was a great point. They said to me, John, getting Fantastic Four, though, if you're Marvel, isn't about Fantastic Four. It's about Galactus, mm -hmm. and it's about and Silver Doom. Surfer, and, and it's Doom. about Doctor Doom. And that made me go, well, okay, wait a minute. Now that's a point. The Fantastic Four themselves proper may be kind of ruined at this point but there's auxiliary characters around it that could still be valuable but i'm still saying if i'm marvel i make no deal i just wait for them to die and not not get those new films well, in there's, production. But there's a deal there to be made i mean it's like and also don't forget fantastic four is marvel's very first character yeah it's the yeah. flagship that's the thing that started and the marvel. very first super team very first super team it's not spider-man it's not hulk it's not it's fantastic four so that's that's something just to honor the legacy of what Marvel is that Disney bought. So there's an bought. emotional element there, too. There's a lot yeah. there. So that's the history of Marvel in general. It started with Fantastic Four. be great to get that back. X-Men, that's Fox's. They're gonna, they ain't they're, never leaving. It's <laughs> never going to leave. I say make a deal. Both studios are smart. They can figure stuff out. It's all about money in the end run when you, it comes with these kind of characters. I agree. Foxes, they've rolled the dice like three times. They're not counting Roger Corman's because that was a different company, but that's true. It didn't work. So I don't I don't see them putting more money into it. I see them like, let, let's get money out of X-Men. Let's make these series work. Let's have the same kind of thing that Sony has with Spider-Man and Marvel. I think there's a way to work it. You know what? I, I was trying to avoid it, but I suppose we should let Mark into the conversation. Mark, <laughs> what do you have to... <laughs> what do you think hey about guys, this situation? Man, that Fantastic Four movie sucked, huh? <laughs> Back to you, John. <laughs> <laughs> I really is fascinating to watch you guys talk about the business side of this deal because like John I was like why would Marvel want Fantastic Four at all I do think the Galactus character in Silver Surfer could fit it somewhere eventually in the cinematic universe but as a Marvel fan I don't want to see them try to mess up everything cool they're doing with Guardians of the Galaxy we just got all this possible in humans news incorporating them into it let's let all those things play out before we try to involve any other characters now as far as Fantastic Four 2 goes yeah that thing's got to be dead at Fox there's no way Fo nobody at Fox is like, hey, you know what's really fun? Losing money and getting panned by critics. That's, a, <laughs> that's fantastic. That's a great that's, week at that's the awesome. office. I mean, at this point, I don't even think Marvel buys into the emotional thing anymore, where it's their first flagship franchise. You know, like Sammy Ball was the Redskins' first quarterback. They ain't trotting him out this Sunday. You know, he's dead. And I think <laughs> maybe they should. <laughs> the Redskins might want to think about it. I just don't know that Marvel cares about Fantastic Four because it's been so tarnished as a movie property. I know fans, it's a bummer to see that, but it just needs to go away Hang for a on. while. What's the next phase? What is it? Uh, it's going to be phase, phase four. Is the yeah. next one, yeah. Phase yeah. four. Oh. Oh, oh I see. Right? We weren't going <laughs> to do it, but then we realized <laughs> the number four is there. Uh, hey. It's feet. It's, it's it feels feet. like it's feet. I tell you. Yeah, they're not going to. Fantastic Four in phase five doesn't feel right. <laughs> Fantastic Four, Phase Four. Hmm. But wait, all Phase, phase Four <laughs> is going to be just six Fantastic Four that universe movies. That's what? it. The world's going crazy. Yeah. Hey guys, if you like this clip, click here to watch the entire episode. Also, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel because it'll help you stay up to date with all the stuff we've got going on here at Collider.